Today, President Biden signed the Respect for Marriage Act into law. NBC's Bree Jackson is in Washington this morning as the White House is urging lawmakers to take a similar action to prevent a partial government shutdown. History will be made at the White House this afternoon when President Biden signs the landmark Respect for Marriage Act, giving federal protections to same-sex and interracial couples. The president will also note that there is much more work to be done to protect the LGBTQI plus individuals across the country. The bill passed Congress with bipartisan support. Now, lawmakers must come together again this week or face a government shutdown. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer is pushing for swift action on a short-term fix. A one-week CR so we can give appropriators more time to finish a full funding bill before the holidays. The two sides are at odds over how much to spend. Top Republicans are pushing for more military funding. If our Democratic colleagues can't accept those realities, the option will be a short-term bipartisan funding bill into early next year. Punting the government spending bill until January gives Republicans time to take control of the House and rewrite it. The Biden administration is urging Congress to use their negotiating time wisely. We believe uh, uh, on the government funding, we believe there is still enough time to get that done. Congress has until Friday to reach a deal to avert a partial government shutdown. In Washington, Bree Jackson for NBC News.